Bye guys. Hey guys, today you're going to come to the barn with me. Here you can see I'm putting my jeans on over leggings because it is so, so cold and I'll take all the extra warmth I can get. I also have on this little vest to keep me warm. Now it's time to get ready. I put my hair in some boring little braids, always. I really don't do a lot of makeup, just like some concealer and that's really about it. A little bit of eyeliner, some bronzer, and I'm good. I'm tucking the extra under the belt instead of going over and through just because I think it looks so much better and cleaner. Since I board my horses, we don't really have anywhere to put the baled alfalfa and baled alfalfa is the best alfalfa. So I have to put it in this giant black trash bag, like a body bag, and take it out there every day for them. But they are always nice and happy for their alfalfa. Why is alfalfa so heavy? Why? When we get there, I turn Zoro out so he can have some time out and so that I can clean his stall when I'm done riding. And he was feeling the cool weather today, for sure. I have to clean scout stall today so he goes out as well he was a little less enthusiastic but he has a friend that's over the fence that he talks to a lot so he wasn't too bored he also rolled in the rocks which could not have i don't know i guess his back itched really bad but that does not look comfortable at all to me and today we are going to ride kite <laughs> Hey guys, today we are going to be riding Kite and we are going to be riding him tactless. But first I'm going to get him all settled up to get him listening, to give him a proper workout. And then we will switch to tactless, which I'm sure he's so excited about. Yeah, you excited? That doesn't sound very excited. Okay. Of course we always start by brushing him and he is covered in lots of dirt. As you can see, he's been rolling and playing in the mud, so I gotta get it all off. So I need to use this little scrub thing, I call it a plastic curry, I don't even know if that's accurate, but I use it. It just kind of breaks up the dirt and it's easier to brush off with the soft brush after. Some of you have asked where my saddle pad is from. I did win this one, but it is a best ever, so I'm sure you can order something um, exactly like it. I really like it. It is my favorite saddle pad. Where? How? Do, how? Why you already had more dirt on me? My saddle is a circle Y. And I also love it very much. It's just very heavy for me.
Um, if you're watching and you know um, about horses or you ride western, you'll know that this is a little too long for him. But I have it set right where I need it for Chester and Scout. And I'm not going to change it. He is fine. It's not going to be on for long anyway. Then we're going to do tackless. It's going to be so fun. Which I've never, I've never done tackless on him before. So we'll see how it goes. I'm going to be in a halter and not a neck rope uh, because. Thing we need our bell boots and we're ready to ride like i said i'm starting with tark to make sure he gets a full good workout i ride him probably about twice a week he's old he does not go to all the shows so i just want to make sure he stays in decent shape i want to do the viral wednesday dance and my goal is for it to be tackless but i'm going to do it with the tech uh, just to make sure i have it like for safety now i have the clip There's so many rocks in this arena, I hate it. Watch this video 500,000 times. I can buy my own arena. You get more videos, I'm just saying. You'll see me walk him a lot more than I walk Chester and Scout before I really begin their workout. This is because he is 22, he is old. So I wanna make sure all the fluid around his joints is nice and warm and walking is so important. So it's good to get him good and warmed up before you ask for anything. Uh, this song is probably copyright, so um, I'm using the Lady Gaga one. So dance, dance, dance with my hands, hands, hands above my head, head, head. Like, eh, okay, you get it. You get it, okay. My goal is to do the dance tag list, but I did that to have a safety to make sure I actually got the clip. So now I'm trotting and giving him his nice, good warm up. He um, hates this arena. I've said it before. So, I promise he's not lame. I can show you all of his vet reports, all of his lameness exams, and his recent chiropractic visit, and show you that he's not sore. He is just a jerk in this arena. And I hate this arena too, okay? I don't blame him. But I do have to get onto him a few times for being an absolute jerk. <laughs> Now I turn around and trot this way because it's important for both sides to be even. So whatever I do to the left, I do to the right to keep him equal and balanced. When I'm done trotting, I walk him for a minute to kind of catch his breath before I ask for a lope. Here's where Grumpy Spicy Kite comes out in full force. I know it's the world's smallest bug, but it is still so funny. Are you serious? Tagless might be fun. Oh no. <laughs> nice and hateful. Are you feeling crazy? Feeling nice and hot? Well, I don't think hot is the right word. What do y'all say? Spice. He's feeling spicy. I'm gonna have to watch that jerk. <laughs> now I'm gonna take him back to the trailer and get all of his tack off and up, and then I will return bareback with a halter. I'm really hoping I don't die. Are you gonna kill me if I don't have a saddle? You know. I know you know. Can you be nice? Just in case. No! No! <laughs> I tried. Kite's favorite thing to do ever is roll, and any chance he gets, he is going to do it. Here, I was absolutely terrified he was about to roll and crush my pivo because he was very close to it. Why? <laughs> I was gonna let you do it. After. <laughs> oh. 
Oh no, the barrel's gonna fall. <laughs> Here I am just testing the waters with a trot to see what happens. You don't know woe too well. She's full of hate. He hates this horse, they're stalled next to each other and you can see her from the arena. Fighting. <laughs> This is also a copyright song, so uh, one, like, two, uh, three, Margarita. Hey, Margarita. More drama. I shouldn't fall off this way. Dude. <laughs> I wish I could clip it to the sides of this base. Hang on. <laughs> Can you back up? Riding bareback really gets my hip flexors going. Don't kill me. I'm so sorry. Now I have the lead rope clipped to each side of the halter instead of just tied under the bottom to give me a better way to steer. Underneath, I know there's no way really for him to feel which way I'm pulling. Still a little too scared to lope. Here I tried the Wednesday dance at a trot tackless and he kind of takes his own path so this was fail but here's the actual thing I'll sing uh, Goo Goo Muck. I turn into a teenage Goo Goo Muck and I roam the city and I'm from the street. I don't know. I don't remember it. Okay this is my tackless Wednesday dance, okay? Don't raise your expectations any further. The side of the halter that I tied kind of skewed up, so I went and pushed it back down. Are you gonna buck if I ask you to lope? I'm a little concerned based on earlier. <laughs> Can you lope like two seconds and be done? Maybe? This is easy. Wait. Oh my god. I had to get on to him so I wouldn't think that he could just act like that and be crazy. And then I was done. That is that I was all tacklessed out. Okay. <laughs> Tackless. You are so free.
anybody that doesn't believe me about soaking pellets, here's where it literally says on the bag to wet them down. After the morning, I got Starbucks. Okay, that's all I did. Okay, bye.